Hi, I'm Sam Young. I'm the veterinarian here at the Greensboro Science Center, and today we're taking a look at Royce, a 22-year-old ring-tailed lemur. The Royce's primary keeper, Megan, brought him down to the hospital for us to take a look at him. To make it easier and less stressful on the lemurs uh, before we take a look at them and collect diagnostic samples, um, we provide Royce with a little bit of anesthesia to make him sleepy. As part of his exam today, Royce is really getting the works. So full physical exam, we're updating his vaccines, uh, cleaning his teeth, ultrasounding his abdomen, getting full body x-rays, and performing a TB test. So when an animal's under anesthesia, just like people, they don't maintain their body temperature. So to help keep his temperature up in a normal range, we provide external heat sources, such as a heating blanket, um, hot water bottles, warm towels, and even wrapping his feet in some cozy socks. In order to provide IV fluids to Royce while he's under anesthesia, our technician Sam placed a catheter in his back leg. We collect a small blood sample from Royce's femoral artery for complete blood count and chemistry levels. This allows us to tell whether he has any issues uh, with his organ function or potentially an infection that may not be aware otherwise. During Royce's dental prophylaxis, we traded off with Hannah, our fourth year veterinary extern from NC State. Hannah's part of an externship program we offer here at the Greensboro Science Center uh, to allow extra training for students interested in zoological and aquarium medicine. As part of the dental cleaning, we use an ultrasonic scaler to remove large pieces of dental calculus. We follow this with a polish, and then we probe the gum line to make sure there are no deep tooth root pockets. At 22, Royce is considered a geriatric lemur, and so we ultrasound him to make sure his kidneys, liver, and other abdominal organs are healthy. The last part of our exam for Royce is a set of full body x-rays. We can use these from past year's exams to make sure there are no issues springing up or we can track changes that we may have noted previously. For the x-rays, we'll transport Royce to our radiology suite. This is a fully lead-lined room to prevent any spare radiation from leaving the space. We'll make adjustments to the amount of radiation that is emitted uh, based on the size of the animal that we're putting on the table. To cut down on the amount of radiation myself and my technician receive, we always try to step outside of the room and take x-rays. Our digital x-ray technology allows us to see images immediately, no development necessary. Just like you, our animals need regular vaccinations as well. Today, our lemurs are getting rabies as well as a tetanus toxoid. After reviewing all of Royce's diagnostics from today's exam, we can give him a clean bill of health, and we hope he'll be a part of our troop for many years to come.